Want to protect yourself from hackers? You need to know their tricks. One of the most common tricks is called phishing. This video explains phishing and how to stay safe. Remember, this information is for educational purposes only. Phishing is like tricking someone into giving you their treasure. But instead of gold and jewels, it's your personal information. Imagine a pirate disguising their ship to look friendly. They might paint it to look like a merchant ship or even a rescue vessel. Unsuspecting sailors come aboard, thinking they are safe, and the pirates steal their gold. That's phishing. Hackers do this online by pretending to be someone you trust. They trick you into giving them your passwords, credit card numbers, or other personal information. They might send you an email that looks like it's from your bank or a popular website. The email might say there's a problem with your account and ask you to click a link to fix it. When you click the link, it takes you to a fake website that looks real. You enter your login details and just like that, the hackers have your information. They can now access your real accounts and steal your money or personal data. It's important to be cautious and recognize the signs of phishing. Always check the sender's email address and look for any unusual language or requests. Use two-factor authentication whenever possible and never share your passwords or personal information through email. Stay vigilant and protect your digital treasure. Phishing attacks often look like emails, text messages, or social media posts from companies you trust. These messages are designed to look legitimate, often mimicking the style and tone of real communications from these companies. It might look like your bank, a shopping website, or any other service you frequently use. The goal is to trick you into thinking the message is genuine. Sometimes it can even appear to come from a friend's account. Cybercriminals can hack into accounts and send messages to everyone in the contact list, making it seem more trustworthy. The message might say there's a problem with your account, urging you to act quickly to resolve the issue. This sense of urgency is a common tactic to make you respond without thinking. Alternatively, it might offer something too good to be true, like a prize or an amazing deal. These offers are designed to lure you in with the promise of something valuable. Once you click on the link or provide your personal information, the attackers can steal your data, install malware on your device, or gain access to your accounts. It's important to be cautious and skeptical of unsolicited messages, even if they appear to come from a trusted source. Always verify the sender's identity before taking any action. Use security measures like two-factor authentication and regularly update your passwords to protect your accounts from being compromised. If you receive a suspicious message, report it to the relevant company or service and delete it immediately. Staying vigilant can help you avoid falling victim to phishing attacks. Phishing emails are very common. They often have urgent subject lines like your account has been locked or urgent action required. The email might have a link that looks real but takes you to a fake website. Text message tricks, SMS phishing. You can get phished through text messages too, this is called SMS phishing or smishing. You might get a text that says you won a prize or that there's a problem with a delivery. Don't click links in these texts. Social media traps. Don't click that link. Hackers use social media for phishing too. They might create fake profiles or hack real accounts. They might send you a message with a link to a fake website or a dangerous download. Android and iPhones, both at risk. Phishing attacks can affect any device that connects to the internet. That means Android phones, iPhones, tablets, and computers are all vulnerable. Protect yourself. Spotting the fish. In today's digital age, phishing attacks have become increasingly sophisticated and prevalent. It's crucial to be vigilant and know how to identify these malicious attempts to steal your personal information. Let's dive into some key strategies to help you spot the fish and protect yourself. Check the sender. Look closely at the email address or phone number. Often, phishing emails will come from addresses that look similar to legitimate ones but have slight variations. For example, an email from support at paypal1.com instead of support at paypal.com. These small differences can be easy to miss if you're not paying close attention. Does it really match the company? Take a moment to verify the sender's information. If you're unsure, visit the company's official website and contact their customer service to confirm the legitimacy of the communication. Remember, reputable companies will never ask for sensitive information via email. Look for mistakes. 
Phishing messages often have typos, grammar errors, or strange formatting. These errors can be a red flag indicating that the message is not from a professional organization. Scammers often rush to send out these emails, resulting in poor grammar and spelling mistakes. Additionally, strange formatting, such as unusual fonts or colors, can also be a sign of a phishing attempt. Don't click suspicious links. Hover over links to see the real URL. Phishing emails often contain links that appear to be legitimate, but actually direct you to a malicious website. By hovering over the link, you can see the actual URL and determine if it matches the company's official website. If it looks suspicious, do not click on it. If it looks strange, don't click. Trust your instincts. If something about the email or message seems off, it's better to err on the side of caution. Scammers often use urgent language to create a sense of panic, hoping you'll act quickly without thinking. Take a moment to assess the situation before taking any action. Be careful what you download. Don't download files from unknown sources. Phishing emails may contain attachments that, when downloaded, can install malware on your device. This malware can steal your personal information or even take control of your computer. Always be cautious and only download files from trusted sources. Use strong passwords. A strong password is your first line of defense. Create passwords that are long, complex, and unique for each of your accounts. Avoid using easily guessable information such as your name or birth date. Consider using a password manager to help you generate and store strong passwords securely. Enable two-factor authentication. This adds an extra layer of security to your accounts. Two-factor authentication, 2FA, requires you to provide two forms of identification before accessing your account. Typically something you know, like your password, and something you have, like a code sent to your phone. This makes it much harder for scammers to gain access to your accounts, even if they have your password. By following these tips, you can significantly reduce your risk of falling victim to phishing attacks. Stay informed, stay vigilant, and always be cautious when dealing with unsolicited communications. Your online security is in your hands. Stay safe online. Subscribe to Cyber World YT. Want to learn more about ethical hacking and how to protect yourself online? Subscribe to Cyber World YT for more videos like this.